The University of Exeter is the UK's uh, fastest growing research university. We're based in the southwest of England. Uh, we have close to 30,000 students from 150 countries uh, based around three different campuses, two in Exeter and one in Penryn in Cornwall. So I think the pandemic forced universities to invest heavily in um, physical infrastructure to support um, you know, hybrid learning and delivery of teaching. And as part of that, I think you know, there's a big expectation from students that digital content in particular has to be you know, super high quality. GVAV are a local AV integrator. We've been supplying the university for around 25 years now. And we came about this project because it was part of last year's summer refresh. I think students have a certain expectation when it comes to lecture capture that they'll be able to review the lecture at a later date to pick up on any content that they missed. Uh, that comes down to high quality cameras. At the University of Exeter we're all about the student experience and student feedback is really important to us and so we had a bit of a challenge where we had feedback from students who were basically saying that um, you know, sometimes recorded content or hybrid content uh, would just be a shot of an empty chair where the academic would just you know walk out of shot. We tried getting around this by um, piloting some microphone based uh, auto tracking systems but whilst they work pretty well they were quite costly and quite time consuming in order to configure. So the Sony SRGs were basically the next evolution of that auto framing system that we're trying to develop. The quality of the image sensor is just fantastic you know compared to other cameras that we've used in the past but also you know we have used Sony cameras for quite some time so, you know, they're a solid brand, they're reliable, and the image quality is what you'd expect from Sony. So I think lecture capture has evolved over time. It used to be a single box camera at the back of the room, and now the University of Exeter has implemented the Sony SRG cameras to capture the lecturer live across the front of the room, keeping them in shot at all times, which I think makes for more engaging content and will only improve the experience for the students re-watching the lectures at home. Ultimately, uh, you know, these cameras are acting as a tool um, for us to be able to eventually you know, deliver a really high quality, immersive, engaging digital content for students. So we're installing them into lecture theatres in our larger seminar rooms um, and uh, you know, they're directed towards the front of the room so they can capture academics and presenters as they walk around the room, which is made possible by the AI-enabled auto-framing PTZ feature on the cameras. We're really happy. You know, it's, um, it's great. They're really responsive. They're very easy to control from our control systems as well just minimal fuss and you know for our, from our end users perspective we've literally made it just a one button press to enable and disable the auto framing feature. So when we demoed this technology to, to colleagues I think one of the most frequent comments was around you know how it just looked like someone was operating the camera. It was just so natural and fluid um, compared to you know, other systems that we've seen before where it's just like you know kind of jerky and it looks like you know you can tell that there's an algorithm there doing something. The Sony SRG camera offers a huge cost benefit for rooms where we implement it uh, using the tracking. It saves us many man days of programming and commissioning, which we used to have to do with older systems, whereas the camera, because it's AI, does it automatically. Uh, we put it up at the back of the room, implement a, sim a couple of simple controls, um, and away we go. You know, for my team is that we're often uh, innovating, but we want to innovate reliably. I think that's kind of key with this product, you know, out of the box it was secure and it just worked. It's just been yeah, far easier than other products that we've used in the past. You know, when we're rolling out new technology, the primary thing is around, you know, does this improve the learning experience? Does it improve the student experience? You know, this is kind of clear to us that, yeah, it would do. You know, like if you are watching this you know, from home, a like recorded session, or if you're joining a session remotely and, you know, you're not seeing the academic, what's the point? Like, you know, you want to feel like you're in the room and you want you want to see the academic as they wander around the room and interact with people in the room. So I think you know, this product you know, enables us to, to, to allow that to happen.